Part 1. How to set up the Microsoft Authenticator app as a verification method. We'll first start by going to mycoast.cccd.edu to replicate the login process. Once at the login screen, enter your Coast College's email account, whether it's your student account or your employee account. Click on the blue Next button. On the next page, you'll enter your Coast College's password. Then you'll click on the blue Sign In button. The following page shows more information is required in order to complete the verification process. You'll click on the blue Next button to proceed. After clicking Next, this will redirect you to a Microsoft Authenticator app page. You can start by getting the app on your phone by installing the Microsoft Authenticator app. You can click on the Download Now link to install the app. This will redirect you to the M Microsoft Mobile Phone Authenticator. You'll click on Install the app and you'll see two QR codes. You'll scan the QR code with your Android or iOS mobile phone. Scan the Android QR code if you have an Android, or scan the iPhone QR code if you have an iPhone. On your phone, it'll redirect you to download the app. Once you have the app downloaded, click on the blue Next button. You'll locate the app on your phone, open it up, and select Work or School. Then you'll click Next. You'll scan the QR code shown on your screen with your Authenticator app. You'll select Scan a QR code on your phone. Once scanned, click Next. On your phone, you'll see a notification present. Make sure the notification matches the one on your screen. Once approved, you'll proceed to the next page. As you can see, the notification was approved. Click on the blue Next button. This has verified that you have a default sign-in method with the authenticator. Click Done. This is confirming that your phone has been set up to authenticate with Microsoft. Select Done and you'll be redirected to MyCoast. Part 2. How to set up text messaging or a phone call as a verification method. We'll sign in through mycoast.cccd.edu. We'll enter our Coast College's email address, whether it's our student email address or our employee email address. Once finished, click Next. We'll enter our Coast College's password. Once a password has been entered, click Sign In. You'll see the more information required for the verification purpose. Click on the blue Next button. This will take you to the Microsoft Verification page. In this example, we are actually going to set up a different method. Select the I want to set up a different method link on the bottom left hand side. You'll click on the link and in the drop down menu, you will select phone. Once phone has been selected, click Confirm, and on the next page, you'll enter your cell phone or mobile phone number in the box shown. You'll have the option to have it text you a code or call you. In this example, we'll have it text us. We'll enter our phone number, 
and select Next once complete. The verification method will send a text message to your phone. The text message is six digits. Once received, enter the six digit code on your screen. Once complete, press Next. We have now set up successfully the text message verification. The following page confirms your phone number as a default sign-in method. Once we press Done, we will be redirected to the MyCoast page. The final part, your next login experience. Next time you log in, use your Coast College's email address. Again, your student or your employee email address. Once entered, click Next. You'll enter your Coast College's password. And you'll hit the blue sign in button. In this example, we'll have it verify via text. You'll see your options to call or text us. We will select text. We have been texted a six digit code to our phone. So we'll enter the following code to log in to gain access. Once the code has been entered, we'll select verify and we have successfully logged in. For additional info or questions, please visit our website. Thank you for your time on behalf of Coast College's IT Services.